What's up, everybody? It's me, Tabby the Toy Guy. Right now, I'm at City Trends looking at their toys. This is going to be a quick City Trends toy video. And before I begin, I'm going to give a big shout out to Ruth because she just told me that diversity is outselling Kenya at City Trends. And if you notice, this Kenya is $14.99, which is the same price as the Magic Cow Kenyas this size at Walmart, but those are better. I'm not going to mention the quality. I'm just going to mention that the quality is different from the Walmart and City Trans dolls. I like to tell y'all that. So, if y'all want to buy these, you can, but don't be surprised if if you think it's something wrong with them because that's how quality works because city trends is not like walmart but this kenya does have a pretty outfit with jeans and a dashiki shirt on and a dashiki headband as we know in 1992 kenya looked it different because i have a 90s kenya at home that i like playing with a lot <laughs> But since I'm a toy collector and a toy enthusiast, that's what I do. Ooh. Here is a baby doll. Sometimes the baby dolls at City Trends that come with the strollers, this one's $10. And most times the strollers are better quality than a baby doll. Cause, but, cause we all know. If you see a baby doll in struggle, somebody's gonna buy it. Cause I got little cousins, and they like this stuff too. So, and I have and my six and five year old cousins, they're not sisters, sisters or anyway. They like playing with dolls when they be at my house. Cause they play with some of the ones I buy to review. So, there's that. So, but I noticed this LOL surprise stuff is popular everywhere and this one ain't number three dollars i may buy this because i collect lol surprise and it's one of my favorite things to collect because if y'all know me y'all know i collect everything i collect dolls action figures anything stuff like this too i don't discriminate in any way how much the 11 piece set is? $4.99. But this one's 7 piece and it comes with a calculator. But instead, that one comes with a pencil pouch and I think two um, of those portfolio folders. But I like this come with the pad. I might buy that Aladdin. Because I got some spell change I can do that with. Because I'm going to Dollar Tree to buy me something to drink anyway. Probably something to cook later on if my folks cook. Nah, I ain't gonna buy him. Nah, I changed my mind. Even though he got the the pants don't bother me because that's how they used to make these when I was little. Especially with G.I. Joe's, either the shirt or the pants were permanent. I mean, that's how that was back in the day. Oh, God. They used to make these dolls back when I was little. And said Trans used to sell them Dean. This ain't number $8, so these usually sell for $15 and family dollar. And this is a Walmart exclusive. Oh, this is a boy baby. I'm glad they're making more of these now. It's, I know it's a boy because it's blue and he got, and he wear boyish clothing. And this one's a girl. I'm glad they're making more black boy babies now because then, back then, only boy black babies, are only boy baby dolls that you see were mostly white here's lost kitties i heard of these and this and there's usually a handful of them in here i 
Here's a Play-Doh Da Vinci. Oh, I want. Oh, I'll see, probably see that Mighty Trucks Slayer. I'm not interested in trucks, but I may buy some of those for my little cousin Trey, cause he like cars. Oh, this in color. And this is centipede. Some of y'all might have grew up playing it. And here's a Zuru X shotgun. Yeah, I know Zuru makes sparkles, funville sparkle girls now. Cause I think I told everybody that on Instagram. Cause Ruth told me that, and I seen Zuru sparkle girl stuff at Walmart. Oh, how much is this? Five bucks. Now I think I'm gonna buy this for myself because I play with Play-Doh sometime. And that ain't number five dollars. And LOL can wait, so. Cause I can buy something to cook with three dollars as well. And, but this actually catches my eye because I got Play-Doh I can throw away at home. But this is fun, but yeah, this was a Click City Trans toy house. I mean toy blog, so yeah.